All right, we're back looking at an article from 2016 about the landmark year for Mason Sommer from 1930s of 1936, success of the Sommer Jazz McCaffrey guitar. So it goes on here, 36 flagship year for Mason Sommer, creation of saxophone balance action, and the success of the Sommer Jazz McCaffrey guitar. The Sommer guitar. There's not much information out there about the Sommer guitars, so we'll take a look at this. Guitar, I mean, guitar jazz. What makes a guitar jazz versus non jazz? It's a good question. There's more guitars. Look at this. Now we add a concert guitar and a Spanish guitar. Start with the medium Ben Davis, who runs Selmer Branch in London. Oh, I wonder if this is related to Selmer UK. And Mario McCaffrey. Young classical guitarist who also studied violin making in Italy. He was in London in 1929. Filed patent 31 for, for a original resonator, which increased the sound. Picture of Mr. Davis there. And he was in contact with Henry Selmer. And built up the factories in Mantis La Villa over his guitars. Things you learn, isn't it? Classical guitar comes out very quickly from these new workshops. A model with metal strings. From 32, two types of guitars are offered, gut strings and metal strings. Three models for gut strings are made, classical Spanish concert. And he had particularly worked on the last model, voluminous body, which contained a resonator. A very innovative cutaway for the first time in a large mouth in D, which allowed the sound to come out of the resonator and the body. Models of metal string are more numerous, but it is the orchestra or jazz model. 33 production is operational. Take a look at this picture here, Coleman Hawkins. I want you to click on these links in the description. 1933 production operational. McCaffrey wishes to resume his concert life. He left Salmon in 34 because of his contract. Uh, production continues, but the resonator was quickly abandoned. In 35, first miles with a small oval mouth appeared. It is this mile that will continue to be manufactured until 52 when, when the guitar workshop closed. In total, they only produced 900 guitars. So about 20 years and 900 guitars. Oh, look at this one, the small, smaller oval on the right-hand side versus the big D oval on the left-hand side. Gypsy Jazz. Big Mouth in D, the Y model. And then the smaller model. And that's what we have today about primarily the summer guitar. Who knew? Anyways, don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and we'll see you later.